Now, without mentioning any names, some shit went down. You were nowhere near the scene, though. But you took the rap. You were G. You wanted to let the streets know. You thought those inmates would show you the ropes. Instead, they taught you how to deep throw and had you getting busy with a Black Johnson like Big Sue's from Peep Show. <laughs> West look humble. What's got an interest? <laughs> Say it again! I make Kanye West look humble. What's got an into the sky? Watch her on the title match. You'll get that jealous twitch in his eye. He'll push Chris to the side like I'm gonna let you finish your line. But my third against Pumpkin Head was the greatest shit of all time! <laughs> He must miss sort of a best performance Oscar. This is Robert Oppenheimer shit. You ain't ready for the slaughter. I got hate for your mother. I got resent towards your father. I wish they spent the $40 on the French abortion doctor, Henry Morgan Collis. You were never born at all. I call the devil for disorder. I'm a Jabberwocky walking. He's a chatterbox in Jabba Jaw, some yappy dog babbling on about nothing. Shit is candy floss. <laughs> and do you know this panty dropping chav has got? Asher Ross entire catalog. <laughs> and he thought Wu Tang was a drink for Chinese astronauts. <laughs> <laughs> Kruger, you look like I'm on acid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm an ass. This is visually strange. This ugly mugs make me question if I'm clinically sane. You look like the infancy stage of a squiggly face drawn by Richard D. James after he binged for three days. Uh. So this is me erasing Bam's future. You blew your shot before you took it. That's a flaming Sambuca. <laughs> that record labels laugh at Kayak. You ever heard a track from Kayak? Y'all are dyslexic if you see an A&R going after Kayak. You had sleepovers all month. Taking breaks between the sex to right. We wrote this shit on the plane. You booked us on separate flights. <laughs> to see him ducked out in person, but that could threaten the event, and this jump spread ain't worth it. His last name is Watts, I'm thinking somehow that's perfect. Let me run down just how this works. If my hand made contact with Watts, I'd probably catch a charge, and if that line gets crossed, it can shut down the circuit. Whoa! You catch him at one of these rap events, you talk all tough. You see him at a jungle party, he's like, Nah, it's all love. <laughs> Mashed up with a glow necklace, throwing pom-poms up. You're like the Dutch authorities. You're soft on drugs. <laughs> Last time I went to his town, here's how the visit went down. Specifically how we dropped by his crib for a flip and then we bounced. Me and Osa went to Camden for some pictures of stout, sipped a few rounds, and shit, I guess the kid just blacked out. <laughs> I dip by myself. Crawl back into your house, through the window and crouch. I fucking took a shit on the grout. You were scared of what would happen if you tried taking me out? So you let him sleep it off. And I pissed on your couch! <laughs> Last night, went to her office. She was looking kind of cute. Said me she'd give me a peep show. We went to a private room. Shameless, got in between her. Shit, what was I to do? She sucking her to choke through a garden hose. Now that's a mighty boost. <laughs> Ended up getting caught in that web he made. In a cell, getting juiced like a fresh squeezed grape by a couple jocks who look just like Respect B.A. <laughs> you getting banged. I'm Jason Voorhees, drinking virgin blood in a pagan orgy. Break a 40 bottle, cross your face, and make you say you're sorry. A range of warbies, going out in a blaze of glory, climbing 80 stories up the shard with planes are aiming for me. <laughs> My brain's on warp speed. I got fucked up head problems like Hunter S. Thompson when he stuck his best shot at his fucking head. 
212 with Shazam and Nils had all the thrills of a business meeting. That shit was so fucking boring, even Nils pulled out a pillow sleeping. He went for unlimited rounds and ran out of film that weekend. If you did a promo overtime, you would you both, both be, be still, still in Sweden. Sweden. <laughs> well, let's get this clear. Nah, it's not a choke. A moment of silence for Bam's career. Let's go. You jelly bean headed motherfucker. <laughs> you getting out class clown. So anyone judging don't mean at 6.30 in London when they say Big Ben, hands down. Wow. Time.